Hello there everyone, my name is Orca and welcome to another Let's Play episode on the Cosmicity server. Well today, I am going to be showing you some of the things we have been doing behind the scenes. Well, technically not behind the scenes, but you, you get the idea. And yeah, like for example, we have this castle now. Well, we're working on it, but it looks pretty good, I'll have to say. And yeah, I, th I think we've, we just need to do a bit of work here and we will have something that fits the rest of the spawn area, which includes these player stops and what, Nebula's little, yeah, I think Nebula's been trying to sell melons. I mean, I like melons. They're, they're good. They're good for training with villagers. They're just nice things to have in the winter. Did I say I eat melons in the winter? Um, yeah. Uh, moving on. Anyways, today we are going to be checking out something we have been working on for the last few days, which is this mall or well not the entrance to it the entrance is still the same it's the inside that we will be taking a look at today so let's dive right in so we are inside the entrance to the mall now as you can see we've got outside area here and if we just walk down here we can go down these elevators right down to the mall and yes we do have our event so story which is well ending that you know like if we have an event where you need a certain item to enter somewhere then that would be sold here and of course we do have our, our little staff area um, yes, you can see our health, which means that everyone can come and if they see I'm on and I have not been a good little fishy and eaten my, f my uh, steak like I usually do, well, yeah, they, they, it has happened and I do walk along the server at five health or less um th that it's not fun when i have to go look for food but yeah anyways we do have our mall area here and uh yeah we do have our mall here and it's pretty authentic we've got our several stories levels, whatever you call them, our little sitting area down there, which we will take a look at in a second, our mall bulletin board or what, whatever you call them, we even have an ad, popcorn, only one dollar per exclamation point, uh, I wrote that sign and I don't even know what it means, and, and yeah, um, I've got our, our info cards, we even have an ATM with stairs underneath, we have stairs underneath here so you know you can actually access your stuff, but yeah I, I like how it looks from a distance, pretty close to real life, at least for me, I mean I could have probably picked a different kind of trap door, but you know, small details. I I'll figure those out later, and yeah, probably, maybe, something I guess. Either way, we have these cute little elevators, which took me way too long to figure out a design for. We have one at each end. This one is the up elevator, quite fast, as I see so myself, and ow, okay, note to self, don't fly, wait, what, did I just, 
Oh, okay, wow. Okay, you know. F5 is weird. Anyways, we've got our down elevator, which is much, much slower, and I appreciate that because I don't like dying on magma. And, with, and of course, or you know, you could just fall over the balcony, which I did not put a railing on. Typical. But yeah, anyways, once, oh, okay. Anyways, once you get down here, we have this certain area where we will sometimes change it up depending on what we are going to do with it. We'll have all, so like, if we have a competition or something, then this whole area will get changed to be a competition area and so forth because, you know, why not? I mean, we have this whole area and we can use it. So, yeah. Um, anyways, as for shops, depending on how much you pay in game with in game money, you can get a shop of varying size. Like, this is a very small player shop that maybe at most one, two, three, four, five, like maybe six, five or six chesses single chest uh, something like that and but yeah this is an example of it and yeah um there's not much else besides that besides the more you pay the more space you get and so forth and yeah i think that's most of oh yeah the popcorn stand i built this out of boredom it sells actual popcorn so you're probably wondering, Orca, where is your shop? Well, this is my shop. Yes. This is my little hidden shop. You will have to find it for yourself if you want to buy something from me. There will be discounts, of course. This is just temporary. So I remember how much I'm selling things for otherwise. But yeah. This shop will always be on the move. That's right. This shop will always be on the move. So once the stock runs out or whenever I feel like it, this shop is m moving out. But you know, I can't just expect you to just randomly find a shop. Even if I do say, it is going to always be at spawn for the time being. But yeah, I can't just say that, oh, I have a shop, come find it. No, I have to give you some kind of hint because otherwise you will never find it. And here's the hint. Yes, it is under spawn. But yeah, anyways, that's it for me from now. That, yeah, um, yeah, um, so you have to see my feet feel. Anyways, yeah, that's it for me. Because I do have a time limit on these videos, and I've spent plenty of time here today. So yeah, anyways, do come find me by the time... I finished putting out this video. I'll hopefully have some better set up. Of course, our economy system isn't quite set up yet. Well, I think, anyways. So, you know, shops aren't exactly viable, but if you do find this shop, you can always come message me on Discord and I will happily give you a discount on whatever I'm selling down here. Anyways, that's it for me for the time being. And so keep on adventuring and I'll see you on the servers. Bye. Wait, what, what did I break with? Oh, I broke the ceiling. Of course I broke the ceiling.